So today we'll be discussing a very important topic and that is amniotic fluid embolism. What is amniotic fluid embolism? It is entry of the amniotic fluid into the maternal circulation and it presents with a classical triad of hypotension, hypoxia and coagulopathy that is DIC. When does it happen? It usually happens in the immediate postpartum period. Once she, the patient delivers, she suddenly collapses. So postpartum collapse is the most common presentation. It may happen intrapartum also before delivery, especially when you do an ARM or when you start oxytocin, amniotic fluid may enter the maternal circulation. How do we diagnose this condition? So diagnosis is basically the presentation postpartum collapse in the absence of any coexisting feature and it is a diagnosis of exclusion. So there is no definitive diagnostic method. But if the patient dies because it has a high mortality, what uh, it can be diagnosed on an autopsy by finding the presence of fetal squamous cells um, or amniotic fluid in the lung tissue or in the pulmonary circulation. So, how do you treat this? It is treated by immediate resuscitation, correction of the DIC and if the patient has not yet delivered, then immediate delivery needs to be done. So, this is about amniotic fluid embolism. In the recent NEET PG 2022, we had a question on this. The question was collapse in a patient during labor or delivery followed by bleeding and DIC in the absence of coexisting conditions is due to what? So, write the answer in your comment section and let me know.